have two. Make that three. Oh, hello. Hello, my sweetheart. Say hi. We just wanted to stop by and say hello before our bath. Well, can't he stay and play just a little longer? No, no, no. Bedtime, bath time, very strict schedule around here, girls. Oh, it is like a nursing facility. Mm, it's even stricter. I will bring him back right when we're done. Okay. Mm-hmm. Enjoy your main man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> bye bye. Say bye, Katie. Hey, come in. Yes. Hey. <laughs> Look at you. Nice. Oh, hey. Just Did giving your sister a checkup. Huh? Yeah? Yeah, one of the perks of having the doctor in the house. Well, no, there's one thing this house has that ours doesn't have. Oh, thank you. Yeah, not so the sweet. only oh, thing. Yeah. Want to hold him? Oh, no. No. Why not? You're great with Hope and RJ. Yeah, but they're... Oh, really, they're not babies. They're all you know, tiny and fragile and... Kitty, I hope you know you would have been welcome to stay with us. Oh, thank you so much, but you guys are newlyweds. Well, so are Nick and Bridget, in a manner of speaking, unless I've misconstrued the living arrangements. Dad. You know, Eric, it's really not the honeymoon thing this time. It's more about Jack. Katie needed a place to stay, so we opened our door. I was going to go to a recovery center. I didn't want to be a burden to anyone, but Nick and Bridget wouldn't hear of it. And I can't tell you what it means that you've opened your home to me around people I love. The doctor stitched me up, but you guys are going to help me heal. Thank you. 